fan and a chair. So grab a chair here and you're gonna put the resistance band on the floor. You wanna make sure that it's nice and evenly spread out. So it's gonna be nice. So you wanna just make sure it's even on both sides and then you're gonna grab your chair and put your chair right on top of it here. And I'm gonna sit with my back towards the, the back edge of the chair here. And I want you just to really pay attention to how my back muscles move. And this is gonna be imperative. All right, and then you wanna sit squeezing the chair here. And actually, you know what? Yeah, this would be good. Okay. So you actually wanna sit squeezing the chair here as you grab both sides of the resistance band here, okay? You just wanna pull up on it. And I have my palms facing forward here as I grip, so I'm gonna show you just a little side view. This is what it would look like here. But my palms are facing forward. I'm gonna pull my abs in. I'm gonna pull it out and release. And we're gonna repeat that about nine more times for a total of 10, just to get deep into the back here. Try to keep the shoulders pressing down. We wanna keep the shoulders away from the ears here for four and three, two and one, good. Now we're gonna only use our right hand. We're gonna pull back. And actually, before we go into our next one, let's go ahead and scoot ourselves back so we can get a little bit more leverage here, okay? And then we're gonna have our palms facing away from the chair. Like if I could give a thumbs up, I'd be able to here. All right? And then I'm gonna, and I said I'm already, I've already scooted back. So I'm gonna, ugh. So now I'm gonna scoot back towards the edge of my chair here. And I'm gonna now turn my knuckles so they're facing the ceiling, sitting up nice and tall. I'm gonna punch up and come back down, keeping my elbow either in line with my shoulder or slightly below it, whatever I can maintain. For five, four, three, two, and one. Do the other side. Here we go. Knuckles facing the ceiling. Come up, back down, whoops. So knuckles facing the ceiling here. Other side, knuckles facing the ceiling. Punch up, come down. Punch up, come down. For eight more, squeeze that black. Four, ooh, this is hard. Three, two, and one, good. Now, you're gonna come off the chair here, all right? And I'm just gonna have to edit this part. Your now chair should be facing sideways, okay? And then from here, bring your left leg back, right leg forward, you're gonna pull and release. Pull and release. Looking straight ahead here, bracing the core. For five, four, make sure you're grabbing even on both sides. Three, two, one, good, go ahead and switch. Slightly pressing the knee into the front edge of the chair gives you a little more leverage. Here we go, for 10. Keep the core nice and tight, shoulders down, try to squeeze the back, four, Three, two, and one, good. Make an X, make it a little bit more intense here, okay? So now, the legs will be parallel, soft bend in the knees here. Pull the abs in your hinging forward. You're gonna pull it apart and release, nice and slow. Mm-hmm. This feels really intense, but in a good way. Really building those back muscles here. You have five, four, three, two, and one. Good, slowly release. Now I would advise you repeat all these exercises again, just to get a little bit more of a workout. Maybe two to three times is ideal here. So 